Hi, I'm Baby Duck. And I'm Boots Electric. And we are Eagles of Death Metal. And this is Enemy.com. .com. Or is it dot .kim? It's dot, that's only in Korea. <laughs> oh, no. Why should people be excited about the new Eagles of Death Metal album, Steve? Yes. Why? There's several reasons. It, uh, it actually ends global warming. It's a <laughs> and it's a cure for hunger. The yeah. hunger for... For something fun. For, for rock music. What does it sound like? Our album sounds like... Can I say the John Holmes thing? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like John Holmes, but with a bigger dick. John Holmes was probably one of the single greatest cinema artists of all time. Uh, using art in the loosest sense of the term. More like a naked lady French film. Yeah, and he had a big, like a baby's fist holding an apple, you know, artistically speaking. Yeah, yeah. Why did the new album take so long? Well, it didn't. We don't believe in a certain time. We believe in right on time. Yeah, and I think, you know, um... Yeah. Therefore I am. <laughs> it didn't want anyone to know, and I was like, you just gotta come out. That closet isn't big enough to be in your whole life, and you gotta do this for yourself. Sometimes it takes a little coaxing. To get you out of the closet. And this album will have a permanent out-of-closet experience in October. <laughs> out-of-closet experience. No, I mean, we don't worry about the spark being gone because... Uh, <clears throat> it's the same spark that the Olympic torch uses. And you know that's always kept alive in some country or another, so... And they don't call us Sparky for nothing. That's right. Not for nothing. Actually, they don't call us Sparky for nothing. Yeah, I don't think so. Not for anything. No one's ever called me that. What songs in particular are we excited? Well, I think we're just excited for the whole thing to just be freed. The day it comes out, I've, uh, I've hired a, uh, a bunch of doves to be released uh, at my house. And uh, each one has a song named Tattooed on it, which probably is going to get me in a lot of trouble. But they will be freed and let into the wild. So catch one. <laughs> There's a place in California called Gold Lake. I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, 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 no. Um, Silver Lake is a place in L.A. that's it's, it's like a township. Is that what it is? It's like a little village within L.A. It's a hamlet. It's a hamlet. And, and to sum up Silver Lake, I could tell you this joke. How many persons in Silver Lake does it take to change a light bulb? It's too complicated a number you wouldn't understand. Oh, uh, how many surrealists does it take to screw in a light bulb? Apple, fish, arm. <laughs> well, we have this thing where it's like, you know, don't try to be hip, just shake your hip, you know what I mean? Like, um, it, the, people sometimes get caught up in that thing where they try to predict what someone they don't know might think about them, and that's, you don't have to worry about all that. I think you just have to have a good time and, and uh, work hard and uh, sing along with the rest of the dwarves as you run back to the forest to their little house. <laughs> is there an overarching theme to the yeah, album? I think fun is the over. I mean, don't take the wrong stuff too seriously, take the right stuff seriously, and, and there's not a problem that shag and ass won't normally get you out of. Yeah, I think, uh, I think that was well said. Thank you. How sexy is this record? It's like, this album is like, compared to the other albums, the other albums are like Brad Pitt and Thelma and Louise, but this is like Antonio Banderas in Interview with a Vampire meets Brad Pitt from Thelma and Louise. So you so, didn't think those were going to be added together? Yeah, think they could and happen. bingo, they are. It's done. But, but I would have Antonio's hair be a little bit shorter because I wasn't totally sold on the long hair. But overall, yes. Would you really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the album artwork for the album for Zipper Down was, uh, was shot by Chapman Baylor, who's a, a wonderful photographer. Uh, the model uh, whose nipples we play the part of uh, is a friend of ours named Monica. And I play uh, right nipple, Joshua plays left nipple. We studied for these parts. Um, we're method actors, of course, so <laughs> yeah. it was a very intense study I went process. to Juilliard and, uh, and had people suck on me. <laughs> a long time ago. Well, the title of the album is Zipper Down, and, and what's great is it's just not that complicated. It's, it's just a way of life, you know? Zipper down. Why zipper up? The most challenging thing about making the record? The deficit. Yeah. Um, Just in general, it's fucking everybody up. Balancing our budgets. <laughs> um, it's fun to make the records, and that's, that's not... 
it's, I think it's the hard. most challenging part is coming to terms with the fact that it was <clears> going to end. Yeah, because we, we have a good time making the record, so <laughs> you just made the boo-hoo face. I was like, oh, but it's fun to make the record, so uh, knowing when to stop is important when you're driving.